Hey guys, what's up? It's Aries with the prototype hard difficulty walkthrough. Um, what we're going to do uh, for this mission is we're going to start out, or what I did, um, is buy the critical pain devastator ability, which you have to buy the palm slap or slam ability first, and then you can buy the critical pain. Um, this is uh, an extremely powerful move, which it's condensed into a small amount of space. Um, and also, I buy consume boost and then um, the regen regen rate and regen d delay and that's it and I'll see you after the opening cutscene Alright, we're back. Um, what you want to do is as soon as you get control of your character, you are going to... I would suggest changing into military personnel. If you don't have a military disguise, then um, make sure you get one before you start this mission. Right there is a super soldier, so you want to completely avoid him because he acts as a viral detector. Um, so just fly over to this building over here and completely avoid him. Because he's the last thing you want to run into. So just run over here. Um, the blood tox in this area is poisonous, so if you see the commander inside the blood tox area, then don't go for him. And then just run up, consume him. We'll give you a little nice objective completed. Get out of the blood tox as soon as possible. Because it can hurt you real bad, as you just saw. And just go ahead and ditch your gun that you have and then start the convoy and then you'll tell everybody to move along now what I like to do is I like to use the helicopter um, so just run back a little bit get in find it the easiest just because of uh, obviously safety is the main thing so, while you're going across here, the only thing that you will have to fight at all is Hydras. Um, if you want the achievement for picking up, or for uh, throwing something back at a Hydra, right now would be a good time. I didn't, because I don't really care about the achievement all that much, and if I'm going to get it, it'll be in another playthrough. But, um, yeah, just uh, stick to your... Um, stick to your missiles, not your lock-on missiles, but your missiles because the main gun's too, the machine gun's too ineffective against them on hard, and you don't have a lot of lock-ons. Um, so, same rules about Hydras apply. Your uh, tank buddies will do a fairly good amount of damage to Hydras. Um, so keep that in mind. You want to take out the Hydras as soon as possible. You don't want to wait at all, because um, the blood tox uh vehicle can get damaged very easily by the cars that get thrown and yep not really much else to say at this part um going back to my dispute about the difficulty unlock i heard from somebody that or uh not from somebody on game facts it's posted that to get the hard difficulty beat it on normal um, so, at some of these parts, some of the hydra, if you're con if it doesn't say the convoy is under attack, um, and hydras pop up, then just uh, shoot at them a few times to get the aggro on you, so they don't start tossing cars. The blood talks. Um, the tanks will deal with the majority of the uh, normal infected on the ground. So, and no hunters pretty much come out at all. Um, don't worry about ammunition. Um, 
I got a little, I got low right at the very last fight, but at that point I wanted to use the really strong missiles. Um, yeah, the Hydra, the Hydras will toss cars at the Blood Talks a lot. Um, good strategy as far as taking them out. Try to only bring one up at a time. And. Most of the tanks, if not all of them, will survive the entire trip, so um, you'll have a lot of backup at a lot of parts. So then they'll say regroup. Go ahead and do that. So just keep that up. What you might want to do to save some ammunition is use the minigun, or not the minigun, the uh, main turret ammo for the helicopter on the Hydras that don't have little skulls on them. Um, again, it's completely up to you what you want to do. Um, Now, right here, you will get ambushed by about three Hydras. Um, just focus on one. The one that you focus on, the majority of the tanks will also focus on. Um, so, um, also, when they start going down, just ease your way back and then go down to ground level and, ult and try to only bring up one. Uh, when you do that, all the tanks will just focus on it, and it won't be able to do anything at all. So then just move up a little bit more, get the next one going. It's very simple. And then coming up at this last part right here, there will be f four or five Hydras that you have to fight at the same time. Um, right here, the convoy will take a pretty good amount of time regrouping, so just wait for it. Um, just as a skill of difficulty, I did not have to redo this, or I didn't fail the mission by the Blood Talks getting blown up. Um, my first run through, so it's not difficult at all. Um, if it's going to get destroyed, it's going to get destroyed at this next part. Um, it's the most difficult just because of the sheer amount of hydras spawning. Um, And I think this is, no, coming up. Yep. Oh, no, there was another one. So here I was at about 19 of my main, or secondary missiles. Um, you want to use the lock-on missiles for this last part, um, which is why you probably wanna wanna, would have wanted to save them. Because you want to take out these hydras as fast as possible. Um... Hold down the trigger, 
once they start going down or burrowing. Just aggro them up. Go for the weaker and then take the last one out. And then we are done with the level. Next up is defending it and then the Elizabeth Green boss battle.